Uh, well, girl, if we're going to be here, we might as well go ahead and talk about her. You, know, you said you were savoring her. Well, you know, we just building it up. Because <laughs> obviously you're ready to go in and claw her back up. I am. Okay. So what did you want to talk about before we get to the talk? Uh, make the people sit through this. Since yeah, they, yeah, yeah. Since they want to get on you about Todrick. Make them sit through your little Correct. Time. Because if you think that he clawed Todrick, you wait till he gets over here to... Correct. To, to Latasha Scott. To Shalandria. Right. And claw her back out. With her lemon head ass. <laughs> you remember the little candies, lemon heads? Now that Latasha Scott look like one of them little lemon heads on the front of the box. Put that picture up there, please. Like Tasha K's son. Are you not saving her, y'all, boy? No, we ready. I'm ready to get it. You ready to get her now? Right now. Oh, God. I'm sick of her ass. <sighs> I'm so sick of Latasha Scott. Let me tell you what her problem is. See, she thought. But that where's the picture? No, put ahead, the picture. She thought because <laughs> look at her. Now wait a minute, Craig. We got We kind of favor a little bit. No, no y'all don't. Thank you. Girl, <laughs> she gets on my nerves. Let me tell you something. She thought that because she was quote unquote the lead singer of Escape, that the group couldn't go on without her. But they show her that one monkey don't stop no show. <laughs> Them people done been on tour. Without her, TV and she, show, right? TV show. Well, she was on a TV show. She was in and out of that. She's sitting right over here in Latonia Stone Mountain somewhere in that little starter house. Girl, don't do Latonia, girl, because it's a, I, it is there are noise houses out there. Latonia. I didn't say all of Latonia. <laughs> I said her house is a starter home in Latonia. She's sitting right over there with that uh, Rocky husband. Now, let me tell you about her. So, that is the worst case of narcissist, the, 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 the epitome the of narcissistic abuse. First of all, she ain't never paid her sister back that $30,000. Now, I really believe that she and her mama were in on that $30,000 that they got from Tamika. I remember that because we were all here watching that episode. Upstairs in the living room. It's always the church folk. <laughs> now her mama's so religious, but you but you but you managed to justify stealing that lady's part of that lady's money. Cause you definitely had a piece of that 30k. Mama. You think I'm I'm certain. Now Funky Dineva did a little story on this. Tore it up. <laughs> Tore it up. Tore it up. Now Dineva had some lady named Donna who worked at the bus company. So Latasha Scott did some um, video when she was promoting her album, that gospel album that went nowhere. I don't understand how she thought she was going to come on Beyonce's internet uh -huh. and say that she and her husband have an th open relationship and, you know, like we wasn't gonna be able to run that bad. And like she thought that the church folk were actually gonna go and support her album. Now the church folk get into the things. Oh, deeply. The church folks do all of that. Deeply. We fall down. And they get up. How and, many saints was down there that you had to fall down so many times? And I, right. And when I tell you the church folk, <laughs> they into all of those things. Fucking the pastors. Really? I just wanna know how many saints was down there that you fell that many times and got back up. The church folks are into all of those things. They just don't talk about it. It's a lot of things that you can get down with. They talk about all of the things. They just don't. I mean, they, they participate in all of the things. They just don't talk about it. So she had no business talking about that. And then she thought those church people like Donnie McClurkin and Shirley Caesar and all of those people were going to go. Maybe the best album. dick I ever had was sanctified. Hey, y'all, my shot. Oh, glory. She really? thought they were going to buy her album after she said that. So there was a lady named Donna who worked down at uh, the bus station. She was chartering a bus for them to go on this tour. Now, see, this is what you call celebrating too soon. Why the fuck did they have a charter bus? Like, she knew that the album was going to say, girl, we, we've been on tour, and girl, we don't even have a bus. Girl, we rent as we go. <laughs> girl, she should have rented as she went along. Now, this last time that we went so well, honey, we went in style. We did. When we, when we pulled up there to... Um... <laughs> Up to the Nashville up City Winery. Up to Nashville City Winery. We, we pulled up there in a, in a noise machine. Yeah, that's right. That's right. And a nice third team. Even Mo was over there sleeping and sleeping and snoring, honey, all the way up there, honey. Too. Sleeping. He was hibernating. <laughs> <laughs> he was hibernating. <laughs> honey, like a grizzly bear. We were black outside, red guts on the inside, honey. <laughs> noise. Right. Now, she should have just rented her little something. Or get, did what we did. Like I don't understand why she why she 
Why is she on it? Well, the bus got repossessed. Wait a minute, Craig. Come on now. Craig going in. Come on. The tour bus got repossessed after she did that live video talking about she was about to release her album and she ain't got time for the escape girl. Oh, no, you got plenty of time because you ain't working. <laughs> you this close to going down to the Department of Family, uh, down to the D, not defects, <laughs> Department of Labor <laughs> to get you some unemployment benefits. And then she got to know to be tussling with them about the trademark because she and her sister have the trademark to escape. Candy and Tamika, not Tamika, what's... Uh, tiny. Tiny. Tammy, I mean, Candy, Candy and, and tiny. tiny don't even have anything to do with the trademark. Oh, wow. Tamika and Latasha own the trademark. But that trademark ain't, ain't giving you shit. It ain't putting no money in your pocket. So she's trying to cause some foolishness between them. But it's like, girl... Stop poking that bear because what's going to happen is your sister going to end up asking you for her 30K and putting you. And then Doniva said there was some other checks that came up missing. It's that husband, Myrtle. No, it's that husband. Oh, they said that it's Latasha that and her husband are struggling. But it's that husband, though. They said she broke. Well, Craig, it's that husband. But she was tiptoeing in her heels over on that reality show, getting in and out of that Maserati. Was that a loner? I mean, you can get a Maserati. Well, she need to trade that in if they... You can get a Maserati. I know a girl right now that has a Maserati. Does the girl have money? No. Oh. No. So Maserati is really easy to come by like that? You didn't see them people getting that Maserati right down there from Carvana? That's why they was up there. Girl, she down there broke. Cause she walking around with, with that with that blonde hair in her head, with them heels. She she was looked like she fell out of a magazine. And they broke. Girl, and you should have made amends and been on tour with these people. And Escape and SWV, they are co-headlining. Some cities SWV open, some cities Escape opens. But they they share the billing. Their names are the same size on the flyers. They breaking bread. This lady over here, she about, to, you know, she need to call Adina Howard, get her a job. Girl, that lady is not down there to the Dale FedEx department. <laughs> Craig, you will not keep slandering Adina Howard on this show. Latasha Scott. Damn. <laughs> Latasha Scott. You about to be waiting tables, girl. <laughs> girl, she done fucked up her blessing. Down to the Applebee's. Down to the Applebee's. So, so y'all think it's the husband that's really fucking up her career like that? Yes. And her, and her ego. But and the, her ego. Well, the ego is the ego she has, but also the the husband's help. That ego is dangerous. That husband is even dangerous because he's also adding to it. You the best, bitch. Right, oh, bitch. You the best. Okay, okay, yeah. What the fuck they gonna do without you, bitch? You the best. And instead they of, and, and they showing of, her instead of him tapping her on the show, say, bitch, you better go take. Bitch, you better get right with your sister. They <laughs> showing her, bitch. Let's go down here and use the last four digits of my social and the last. <laughs> And the, and the first three digits of yours and get this money together, get your sister back this thirty thousand dollars that you know we spent. And stole. Me, you, and your mama. When I stole. say when, when I say she's sitting at the house in her duster in her bonnet while them ladies are going around the country touring, singing Who Can I Run To? When I need love, sweet love. Have my mind is so confusing. Who would be that special one? Okay, Every day I ass. try to find it. Oh, no, no. Where did I go? When I took it out of me, I have strong determination. I don't even want to sing her part. No, yeah. <laughs> And that's actually my favorite Escape song, which is not their song originally, of course, because it's a remake, but that's my, my favorite song by them. Who can I run to to share this, uh, this space? She's running right to her mama house, sitting over there with her. Who can I run to? Boom. When I need coins. She sit, she sit, she's sitting right at the house. She's sitting right at the house. Girl, y'all is... Ooh. I don't understand why she... What, what is wrong with her? And that TV show really helped revive a lot of things, with her, but we saw such a dark side of her that I didn't know existed. That's why I feel like reality TV ain't the best for everybody. I'm going to tell you who it destroyed. It destroyed her. It destroyed uh, Nikki from Brownstone. Nikki Gilbert. It tore Kelly, Kelly Price up. I didn't look at Kelly Price the same after reality What, what it did to Nikki Gilbert? Everybody plays a fool. I 
like this ain't my fault for you. I love that fucking song. But what? 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 What, what did it do to her? To Nikki Gilbert? Yeah. Made her look selfish and bossy and mean. What oh, it, it tore Tamar Braxton up too. We don't even know Tamar as a singer. We know her as a reality star. Well, what it did to Kelly? Kelly was, we always knew she was booked and busy, then she got missing it. So Kelly I, was just yeah, nasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I put the APB out on her, the people's over there knocking on her door. <laughs> Kelly, you in here? <laughs> and you know what else? It made me realize that Dawn from In Vogue is the reason that the group fucked up. And she also made me realize that she fucked up Lucy Pearl. What about Jeanne? Sending my love to you. Praying that you are. Where they at? I just told you one of them was on tour. And I said Joan the other day. Her name was Jean. But the Darcy's girl girl's name is something else. Jean is the light-skinned girl that y'all said I look like with the short hair. <laughs> Sealing it with a kiss. Sending my love. Bitch, but Kelly Price, it did give Kelly Price very much so booked and busy. Now, who needs a reality show as a Dana Howard? Girl, and I will be a freak until the day, until the ball. Where and has she boom, been? Boom, 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 boom. Where has she been? <laughs> you keep saying she down there to that damn FedEx store in, <laughs> in Rochester, New York. <laughs> she doing shipping and receiving. Because she got that one song that we all like. Mm -hmm. She it, got two t-shirts and my panties on. I don't know if that really. I don't know if that did that peak. T-shirt and my panties on. Did that peak? T-shirt and my panties. Got my t-shirt and my panties. Adina Howard had an unsung. And my panties on. Oh, I didn't know Adina Howard had an unsung. Did you yeah, know that? It was with Mr. Kelly. She had this old. No, it was Mr. Kelly. No, R. R. Kelly. Kelly? Yeah. T-shirt and panties. Was that with R. Kelly? No. Yeah. Is Alexa on? Is she working today? Is she on break? I'm plugged. I'm sick of her. Well, oh well, I don't know. Are we gonna? You think we gonna get an unsung about Latasha Scott? No, she ain't no solo artist. She thinks she is. We can't do an unsung about Escape because they're not unsung. She's a part of Escape, where she was. They didn't put her ass out. Oh. And then put Latasha out. Latasha put herself out, murder. Right. Because she had all ample opportunity to work with the girl. Right. That ain't that that ego is dangerous. But I'm not trying to be funny, girl. Like they collectively they sound great as a group. Singularly. What you want to say? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Why, why did you position yourself for me to say that? Because I want to see how far you're gonna go. Craig, why line. did you why did you position Because I want to see how far you're gonna go on the line. Why did you position yourself? Because I'm in the room. <laughs> and I want to see if you're really in the room. Are you in the room? Singularly, what now? <laughs> Singularly, what? Let me turn up my miracle ear. Hey, are you stuck? Singularly, what? Because I'm thinking. <laughs> they say Escape does have another song. Girl, Candy ain't watching. Go ahead. Girl, don't do that. <laughs> Girl, go ahead. You don't know who's watching. Girl, what happened? Singularly, what? How do they sound individually? Hello? I'll finish it. So, you know, together, they sound amazing. Candy sounds amazing on that bottom note. Now, by herself. <laughs> but why are we just focused on Candy? Because there's also Tiny. <laughs> well, Tiny does well when she has her little solo moments. And so does Tamika. And the ousted member, Latasha. So who's the best singer out of the group to y'all? The voices blend very well. They do. That's our answer. The voices blend very well. Moving on. <laughs>